have come into your own a little bit more in the last couple of days? What do you think the difference has been? Mm, just uh, understanding more, more of the scheme, uh, just starting to feel more comfortable. Uh, you know, just get my feet wet in these first couple of days at camp, but still uh, knowing that I got a lot more to go. Um, and, you know, just to prove, you know, finishing camp and going, you know, into the season. John Lynch said in an interview in the off season that he thought you might have come in a little bit out of shape. Oh yeah. During the off season program. Yeah, definitely. How much have you changed now? Um, well, that, through the off season, you know, after rookie mini camp and OTAs, I stayed here the whole time uh, with Ray, you know, and his staff, and uh, for uh, you know workouts. I was coming here every morning with some of the vets, and just uh, trying to put um, you know in a good fourth, you know, good effort, you know, just to come in in shape. You know better than what I did. You know for rookie mini camp and OTAs. Does that mean losing weight or getting stronger? Or uh, just a culmination of everything. You know, losing weight. You know, packing on more muscle, losing body fat. Um, you know, position specific stuff. You know, just the whole nine. Kyle did say that he thought that yesterday was your best practice, and today was probably even better. What? How do you determine what a good practice is for yourself? I mean, I'm kind of hard on myself, so I mean. The runs were pretty good. You know, I think I executed all my assignments uh, throughout the team period, but you know, still didn't compete that well in uh, pass protection. You know, so Coach T gonna get on me about that in the film room. But um, you know, it's pretty cool. Coach K said that. Uh, you know, just trying to, you know, uh, go out there and do my best every day. Make you know, give them the reason that they made the right decision. And, First four practices, it didn't look like you were finishing your runs. Did, right. did someone have a talk with you, or did you kind of see that yourself? I mean, I saw it myself and. Uh, Coach Bobby T. I talked to me, you know, just you know, as I you know wanted him to, and I told him to just keep coaching me, you know, just say, keep saying on me, and you know he's been you know that type of positive figure since you know I came in, you know, before the draft, you know, is a big reason why you know I was so happy to be here, you know, be under his wing. So you know he's gonna be on me, you know, for as long as I be here. So you know, I'm just glad that he was able to still see it in me and be positive, so I can keep going out there. Did that happen on the day off? Ah. Uh, I think it was like a couple of days ago. So probably like right before the day off, something like that. So, so now when you watch yourself, are you pleased with what you're saying? Yes. I'm just, just still pleased to the point of, you know, put these practices behind me and then just continue to uh, keep moving forward from here. Drew, did you know in the off season you, you were, I mean, did you know you were coming in out of shape or was it a matter of, oh, geez, there's a difference in the NFL? I think it was more of like I thought I was in shape, you know, just because I was doing a lot of stuff for the combine and pro day. But being out here with, you know, uh, guys who's like eight, nine, ten years in the league who, you know, really have their bodies in shape mentally and physically, um, you know, I wasn't there yet. Um, you know, I really didn't allow, you know, give myself that time to really put in that effort. Um, so after OTAs was done, you know, I really had a game plan. You know, sat down with all the coaches, with Coach T and, and Coach Shanahan. And with Ray, you know, really put forth a nice little plan to get that in place for you know camp and the rest of the season. Aside from the play you kind of you broke down that uh, right sideline running game, a little tough today. Mm -hmm. uh, do you contribute that to maybe some you know growing pains from kind of refor or getting this you know offensive line back together? I guess you could say that. You know, it's really just understanding that what's today. Uh, practice like five six yeah no it's still early in it's camp still but early, still, still you know we're still feeling out the defense we're still feeling out you know each other in the scheme but you know coach Shanahan goes you know over the whole game plan with us every day you know gives us the right mindset and we're just going to get continue to get better every day you guys are going to practice tomorrow here in the stadium yeah have you had a chance to go out there and check it out or what we went out there um during OTAs we had a little workout out there so we was out there that, um, that day doing some stadiums and you know I go out there you know, I sneak out there and just look at the field. You know, it's cool uh, still being here and be playing here a couple months ago. So it's kind of nostalgic to just think back on that. You mentioned you feel more comfortable with the scheme. Is it much different than what you were doing in college? It is because, we, you know, we do some of the plays, you know, under center. Um, but sometimes, you know, we get in the gun and run some inside zone, outside zone. So that's cool. But just being able to have uh, outside zone under the center with you know Coach Shanahan's uh, scheme is nice because I get to use my speed. You know I get to see the whole defense as it you know flows in front of me and get to make my cuts. You know I really feel you know I'm pretty pretty decent in this offense. Tim Hightower, just uh, professionalism. You know obviously being on time, but just the amount of time you got to put into watching film, um, eating right. Uh, just the discipline, you know, to be an NFL running back. 
Um, you know, those him, you know, Tim, Carlos, Juice, you know, those guys really, you know, take me under their wing and, you know, really try to, you know, help me, you know, because camp is a grind and so is the rest of the season. Did you have a fullback at Utah? Nah, we didn't have one. Well, what's it been like <laughs> playing with, with Kyle? It's been great. Uh, you know, just having a person, that, you know, he's like the, the best fullback in the game right now. I um, mean, to see his work ethic, you know, it's like he doesn't he never gets tired, he never makes a mistake. You know, he does everything right. And to just have him, you know, in front of me, just able, able to find a gap for, you know, blocking, you know, it's, it's pretty cool. Is it, I mean, is it sort of like, wow, this is great. I've never had a guy yeah. sort of clearing the way for me where I'm yeah, going. Sort of. Uh, because, you know, he, just, he makes my job easier along with the five guys in front of me, you know, all linemen. Um, you know, they set the tone for the, for the offense and, you know, I just follow their path.